dead with a knee bar. And um, I'd just like you to tell me very briefly about the history and how she came to be a float museum. Uh, she was built in 61. Fishery in 2007, and then she left the scrap to rescue her. And now she's a broken museum. And you have a great personal history attached to Yeah, it was my grandfather and my grandfather. Two of uh, five. Visiting Shetland for a very special reason. Can you tell us about the detail? Uh, now we are doing the thing sea trade uh, together with, uh, with all the things I've seen here in the Western Isles. And you have an exhibition which we've just had a look around to the yeah. stairs. So you maybe tell us a bit more about that. Uh, one exhibition of the thing uh, sites here in the Western Isles, uh, one about the, the story from the coast of Norway. And also here we're designing the field of the project coordinated for the Tinker Project in Shetland. Now, this is uh, quite a special exhibition, I mean, and there's quite a lot going on, so I'll just get you to tell us a bit more about Yeah, well, we're delighted to be working with Percora and uh, the boys on the knee back. Um, they came to us last year with the idea of doing a Thing Sea Trail, bigging on the work that we did for the Thing Project. And, and so they've sailed from Norway down to the Western Islands, onto the Isle of Man, back up to Inverness to go to Dingwall, to the things like there, up to Ark, new to recent Dingwall and St Magnus Cathedral, and move back to Shetland before they head back to Gulating in Norway for the weekend. And you're going over there to be part of the 200, 200 year anniversary celebrations. Uh, Constitution. That's right. We've been invited to go across. Um, um, I'm being asked to represent Shetland and the Thing Project, so tell a bit about what we did and the links we made, and also have the opportunity to speak about possible future collaborations. This project with the NEVAC is really rigged on what we've done already, and we're looking forward to future ventures, um, more so, yeah. tours, and uh, more ways uh, to bring into life this aspect of the Viking heritage. I think it's very important because there are so many links uh, with Norway and these islands that, uh, that we have to find uh, projects to, to, to cooperate about. Uh, and I think we have a good start here. Yeah. Please follow. Thank you. Yes, we have <laughs>